arrested for <laughs> napping on a Walmart and holding a gun during the storm. It's like his blankie on a Walmart. He was on, on a Walmart road. with a gun during the storm. Who knows he's up there? Well, I mean, they've got helicopters and stuff, uh -huh. probably, especially after the storm. Let's figure this out. A Cape Coral man identified as Daniel Ray Rios was arrested after being discovered asleep on the rooftop of a Walmart in Fort Myers, Florida, with a gun in his hand. Uh, the incident led to Rios facing a charge of trespassing. The arrest took place on Saturday following reports of a man on the roof with a gun. Oh, this is police body cam video. This is mm. great. This prompted a response from the Lee County Sheriff's deputies. The situation unfolded when deputies were called to the Walmart located on Six Mile Cypress Parkway. Uh, let's see. Hurricane Helene. Uh, an employee had been inspecting the air conditioning unit uh, after the passage of Hurricane Helene and noticed Rio sleeping on the roof. This prompted the employee to alert the authorities, leading to the subsequent police response. Upon arrival, deputies made their way to the roof and found Rios napping with a revolver in his hand. <clears throat> uh, the presence of the firearm added a layer of concern to the situation. Okay. So as you saw, they went up there with guns drawn. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Reports suggest that Rio had been on the roof. Rios had been on the roof since the previous night, choosing to stay there to ride out the storm. Well, how high <clears throat> was the water, like Melissa said? Well... <laughs> Uh, but you know what? Uh, the flooding is a good point. However, you know, like the tornadoes and the other uh, the terrible weather uh -huh. probably make the highest point you can find outdoors a bad place to be. Yeah, outdoors. Uh, yeah. The decision led to an unusual and unlawful presence on the Walmart roof, culminating in his arrest by local authorities. So there you go. That's an unusual Florida man story that for you. That is very unusual. Yeah. That's not like nap. most of them we have. He was just taking a nap when they found him. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. Looks like a nice spot, though. I'm just not going to lie. <laughs> it's not bad. Yeah, it yeah. looked like he was actually inside, like, a little storage area where they walked into. Yeah. So. A little he yoga was on mat the, down He was here. on the roof, but it was, like, somewhat covered. So. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Uh, well, that's not bad. Yeah. Some people make little forts for themselves inside of Walmart. So have you seen those videos where, where people, like... Uh, they pull everything off of the shelf, and then they they get themselves in a little hut in there, and then they block themselves well, with I, the products. I, I again. tell you, that you, it's very easy to do on the toilet paper aisle. And the right, paper that's where people aisle. do it. Except for yeah. now, because people are clamoring for toilet paper, even though that's Cause not because I I worked the overnight shift in uh, in the land at at Winn Dixie, and mm -hmm. there were, I, there was people that I worked with, and and were like, okay, don't let them do the paper aisle. It's oh, because like, it's, it's like by <laughs> yeah. far the easiest aisle to do. And yeah, you, and you should be able to do multiple, multiple aisles. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's behind the toilet paper. That this guy uh, in the picture. Yeah, yeah. yeah. See, you, you just don't let him do that aisle. Yeah, you, you know who the lazy guy is in the group. <laughs> that's a whole. That's, that's just a customer. That was just a customer that yeah. came in and did wow. that. Wow. Yeah. But I mean, um, it, it is that simple. Yeah, yeah. And we used to do it when I worked at the stock room in Publix. We would. Um, stack up you know pallets of products back there in the stock room and you build yourself a little fort back there where nobody can see you we did a lot of things you shouldn't be doing when i worked at public all i did was work <laughs> <laughs> i, Might worked, I remind I, you i got fired from public oh, okay. well i got fired I too I, mean, <laughs> <laughs> I worked but i also tortured people while i was working oh yeah, so, that yeah, i believe yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. So, yeah. It's an yeah. interesting camaraderie working at a grocery store. Yeah, is it? Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, 100%. And, and, you know, unloading the truck is a different demon all by itself, mm -hmm. too. Mm -hmm. um, oh, I always ran when it was time to unload the truck. Oh, cart duty! Yeah, I was I was a guy in the truck. I, I, I didn't like being the one putting it on all the other stuff because I was too short, but I was tall enough to unload the truck right. from inside. Right. But, yep. I mean, my favorite thing was when we had a new guy... <laughs> We would have them uh, shake up all the Italian dressings. We told them they had to do that. I remember night. that. Yeah, yeah. So you'd, you'd see them out there. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember in the movie Go. I don't know if you ever seen it, but they like they were playing cards like in the uh, the dairy. Like I guess it's like a walk-in cooler, but like behind the dairy, like you could like have like a little fake break room or something in there. I don't know. Did you guys ever do that or no? Like hide behind in the in the walk-in well, we, cooler. We had, we had the uh, bottle room. Like you had return. Right. We had the return bottles. Yeah, like back in the day. Ew, like you, smelly. You would, uh, but it, but no one went and looked for you there. Oh, yeah, true. yeah. So you yeah. either sit there in the stink or. Ugh. 
It's yeah, we would work. make our own little huts in the back and then um, steal Smirnoff ice because nobody uh, drank that stuff. So there was an abundance of no, it back no one there. Knew it was missing. Right. Smirnoff nobody realized it was ice. missing. Oh my yeah. goodness. The yeah. king of the malt beverage. All right. <clears throat> Before I become unhirable, we're going to move on. Yeah, that's why you had to have your home. I think we on. are. That's why we do this. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah I, I think you're right, Davey. I've, been, I've made myself unhirable totally. over the last five years, yeah. I think. <laughs> yeah. That's fine. Hey, uh, Carl Jenkins Jr. 